Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I share with you an amazing high growth treatment that will certainly help your hair to grow faster. Now, this high growth treatment contains ingredients that are certainly known to help promote healthy hair growth and also faster hair growth so i'll definitely suggest that you keep on watching and you watch till the end of the video so you don't miss out on any useful information now before we dive into it guys thank you so much if you're a returning subscriber i really appreciate your love and support if you're new here definitely hit that subscribe button and join the family so you don't miss out any uh, future content for me. So let's hop into the video guys. The first ingredient we we'll need for this recipe will be some fenugreek seeds Now the one that I got is from Whole Foods But I will link everything in my description box from Amazon in case perhaps you want to get it um, So I used about a handful of fenugreek seeds and I just popped that in a bowl and added some hot water to it And allowed it to sit for about 20 minutes. Now you can actually infuse this overnight as well if you want to or you can go ahead and boil your fenugreek seeds just to soften it um, so the next ingredient will be some aloe vera my favorite i love aloe vera guys it's just so good aloe vera is just amazing um, but anyways yeah so aloe vera basically is good for high growth because it contains um, something called proteolytic enzymes which help to repair dead skin cells on the scalp it acts as a great great conditioner for our hair leaving it nice and smooth and shiny it promotes hair growth prevents itching on the scalp reduces dandruff so all of that goodness that you need in order to maintain healthy hair or to grow healthy hair in general so yeah really really good and worth adding to your regimen so I cut a small piece of the of the aloe vera here that I was going to need but again you can use more of this guys if you want to um, and then go ahead rinse it off cut the sharp edges cutting the middle then use a spoon to scoop the flesh of the aloe vera out because this is what we're going to need for this recipe now in case you're coming across fenugreek seeds for the first time fenugreek seeds are actually very good for hair growth as well guys because they're a rich source of iron and protein and these are two essential nutrients that are known for to promote hair, um, hair, healthy hair growth it also contains a unique composition of plant compounds um, like flavonoid and these are actually presumed to induce hair growth due to the anti-inflammatory and antifungal effects so at this point guys i had finished scooping the flesh of the aloe vera out and that's basically what it looked like and then i just popped that in a blender i suggest you use a good blender here my blender is quite old but it's still working so i haven't actually <laughs> got rid of it I'm just using it for my DIYs. I have another blender that I use for, you know, cooking uh, cooking at home. So if you've got a better blender, I'll definitely use that because it will help. I then went in and I poured in my fenugreek seeds that had been sitting around for about 20 minutes. Now the next ingredient will be some avocados, guys. I suggest you use a properly ripe avocado. It's very important that the avocado is wiped so that you can have a nice smooth texture to your treatment and also prevent this from you know getting stuck in your hair now avocado is very good for hair growth guys a study in 2015 found that minerals in avocado oil including potassium and magnesium may actually seal the cuticle cells which helps your hair to look smooth shiny and prevent it from breaking so cut your olive your not olive oil sorry cut your avocado and then pop it in the blender with the other stuff that we've got in it and then we're going to go ahead and blend this up together now i did not add any water to this because the aloe vera um is kind of i mean it's got water in it so i didn't really add water i just blended it for a little bit and checked basically what i got now at this point i still had some grains is it grains like it wasn't like it was a bit rough in texture just like you can see here so i decided to add my fenugreek uh, juice like the water that i had from the fenugreek uh, before and i went ahead and blended it up again and this time around i had a much nicer and smoother texture and this is what i was happy with um again like i said guys my blender is not perfect if you've got a proper blender it will definitely blend it much better than mine did so at this point now we're ready to strain it okay so let's just do that just so we don't have anything stuck in our hair so i used um 
wig cap here but again you can use anything it could be a stocking cap or I don't know a tea towel anything that you've got really that can help you strain stuff so I pulled that in there and then I'm just going to gently squeeze it just to release the um, the mask pretty much or like the mixture so squeeze that gently get all of it out and then that's pretty much it okay guys so at this point i had finished straining it and this is basically what was left behind imagine if we did not strain this this would have got stuck in our hair and it would have been a mission to get all of this out so that's why it's important that you actually strain it and you strain it properly so discard that and that's basically what we're left with so a nice silky smooth mask that just looks so yummy um but <laughs> you know don't don't eat this okay leave it for your hair your hair is definitely going to enjoy this so yeah that's pretty much what the mask looks like guys i went ahead and i added some avocado oil now avocado oil is also good for our hair guys because it contains something called oleic acid and monounsaturated fats and these are actually known to penetrate the hair shaft and moisturize our hair so basically what that means by penetrating is just that it doesn't sit on top of the hair so it actually penetrates the hair itself and keep it moisturized now i also added about a teaspoon of honey now honey is also very good for hair growth because it has um humectin and hemolyan properties so really moisturizing for the hair so essentially just draws moisture from the atmosphere into our hair which is just really really good at keeping it nice and moisturized and shiny as well so when i went ahead then and just mixed everything together until everything was nice and combined and that's pretty much it we're kind of ready to apply this goodness to our hair so stay with me guys i'm going to show you how i'm, I'm applying this to your, to my hair and you can see how moisturizing this thing is like so so good and i'll definitely suggest that you try this out and perhaps you know use it once every week if you can or once every two weeks for maximum results because it's just really good at nourishing and moisturizing our hair which is basically what we need in order to um, keep our hair nice and healthy and to grow that long luscious looking hair that we're looking for So I'm applying this treatment to pretty much clean hair guys. I had literally just come out of the shower from shampooing my hair. So my hair was nice and clean at this point including my scalp. But I did not condition my hair because I was going to use this treatment as part of my deep conditioning routine. Um, I just didn't see the point in sort of conditioning my hair and then using this again. So um, yeah, but you don't necessarily have to use it during your wash day just like I did here. If your hair is clean and it's you know mid wash day it's absolutely fine so just go ahead and apply it still it will be absolutely okay so um, basically I just went ahead and I worked the product through my hair so from my roots all the way to my end so make sure that every single strand of your hair is nicely covered and also massage that to your scalp really nicely apply it to your edges sometimes we forget them edges guys and we need to maintain them as well so they don't break and we can retain them so yeah basically just work the product through your hair as much as you can now i was pleasantly surprised with how moisturized my hair was looking i'm going to show you guys my curls were popping like literally popping you know that just tells you how good and really moisturizing this mask is um so yeah definitely worth trying this is basically what my curls were looking like you know you can see them definition how it was looking so nice and moisturized and that's also the same way that my hair felt after i rinsed this off so yeah really 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 good look at them curls like crazy right um <laughs> so yeah it's just amazing for hair so basically i just went ahead and i twisted that part that i had done and then did like a little banting knot so that it doesn't dry out as i'm working on the next section of my hair and i pretty much repeated this 
throughout the entirety of my hair until it was done. Now I did not record me doing my entire head hair guys because obviously this video would be otherwise extremely long. So I'm just going to show you just a few twists and then basically show you what my hair looked like after I rinsed this off. basically showing you guys here how silky this thing it was looking like so so good like it felt so good to the touch and it felt also amazing to the hair so yeah really really good um how often do you do mask on your hair guys like let me know how often do you use mask in your in your regimen have you noticed any difference since perhaps you started doing mask um let me know let me know you know what you do and what you think has worked um for you in the past it will be quite you know interesting to have um basically some insight into what you do and what seems to be working now everybody's everybody's hair is different you know um and products react differently to our hair so it's quite normal if perhaps you know you tried something and it didn't work it's not the end of the world you can always you know swap things around and change things around until you find the perfect match really so yeah i was just so amazed at my curls like my curls were just popping so extremely amazing so if at this point guys you've been watching and you haven't thumbs up the video please go ahead and thumbs up it's really important because it really helps my videos you know reach more people also guys let me know in the comment section below what kind of videos you want to see from me what kind of content you want me to create um, if you have any kind of you know recommendation or anything that you would like to see definitely let me know in the comment section down below and I'll definitely look at them I mean I always read my comments to be honest I don't always read them on time but I do try my best to read and answer them so I will definitely look at the comment section and look at your suggestions after I finished that guys I just put a plastic bag on my hair and allowed it to sit for about three hours and then I rinsed it off with cool water and basically yeah my hair felt extremely nice and moisturized and shiny and all of that goodness so yeah this treatment is definitely worth trying and if you do guys let me know how you got on with it is this something that you'd like and you like it to do again so yeah this is pretty much it for me today this is basically what my hair looked like guys after i rinsed this off sorry about the lighting it was a bit dark at night time um so yeah this is pretty much it thank you so much for watching thumbs up the video subscribe if you're not already and i'll catch you in my next one bye guys